LGBTQ Pride Parade in Białystok, Poland, met by far-right attacks A Polish city celebrated its first ever march on Saturday, but it struck it to the joyous and hedonistic affairs associated with Pride Parades. Ringed by riot police, around 1,000 Pride marchers walked defiantly through the streets of the northeastern city of Białystok as thousands of nationalist football ultra fans, far-right groups and others threw flash bombs, rocks, and glass bottles. As counter-protesters yelled God! Bags of flour and other objects were thrown out of communist-era housing blocks at the Pride marchers, who were moving along a 3-kilometer, 1.8-mile route through the city center. According to Białystok's police spokesman, Tomasz Krupa, the violence led to the detention of 20 people, four of whom were suspected of committing crimes, including the use of threats and insults against officers. The city of 298,000 people is located in the conservative region of Podlasy, a stronghold for Poland's ruling right-wing law and justice party, known by its acronym PIS. According to anti-racism groups, Białystok has become a byword for its strong far-right movements. Many. But the hostile atmosphere did not dampen the mood of a multi-generational group of marchers, who described the event as a victory in their fight for more equality despite the threats. I. Saturday's march was one of 24 parades scheduled to take place this year in Poland a record number that campaigners say is a reaction to Phoebe Poland's Catholic leaders and pies. We. According to officials, there were about 32 protests registered for Saturday, the majority in opposition to the Pride March. These included a family picnic at Białystok's Branicki Palace organized by Artur Kosicki, the Marshal of Podlasy and an outdoor prayer vigil next door at the Roman Catholic Białystok Cathedral. Białystok's Catholic Archbishop Tadeusz Wojeda by attending the picnic, adding that the LGBTQ march was an the picnic had bouncy castles, folk musicians, and the local army regiment exhibiting its artillery. CNN approached, minutes later, more flashbangs were heard in the near distance, set off by far-right groups outside the complex as they attempted to block pride marchers from proceeding any further. The march ended soon after 5 p.m. local time, after the police deployed stun grenades and pepper spray to clear the far-right protesters. Some pride marchers were seen removing their makeup, hiding their rainbow flags and wiping off glitter. They told CNN, many polls in the country's urban centers are supportive of the push for more LGBTQ rights, with Warsaw hosting its largest pride parade earlier in June. But there has been resistance elsewhere to the community's increasing visibility in a country where same-sex marriage and adoptions are illegal, and anti-LGBTQ attacks are not considered a hate crime by law. In the run-up to October's general election, PIS party leader Jaroslaw Kaczynski framed the opposition's support for more equality as an attack. I. Critics say the tactic helps rally its more religious and rural base. All. The environment has emboldened right-wing media and far-right organizations. This week, the Warsaw-based non-profit campaign against homophobia kilometers per hour told CNN that more than 30 councils had declared themselves free of LGBT. In Białystok, leaflets anonymously placed around the city ahead of the march said that streets would be contaminated. Even. Raindrop, drop, 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 dr